spoken, but I know we tried. Yo, forgive it. Probably both. Yeah. Probably both. Disappear in the woods and work nine to five. Or, <laughs> or <laughs> nine to twelve. <laughs> Midnight. <laughs> yeah. It's a little more like it. Yeah. <laughs> we, we have, we, we place very high standards on ourselves and the work that we do. Um, so we recognize the importance of putting ourselves in an environment um, that we can develop in a free enough way or in, in be inspired enough um, to produce the quality of work that we want to do. And being that we're trying to change the subject matter and a little bit of the uh, a little bit of the, the presentation. We're not looking for reinvention, um, but we do want to evolve, and we uh, look forward to like getting into a space that offers us a, more freedom. I think that that record was a one-time thing. Um, I'm looking forward to exploring different things. So, yeah, taking our time, reflecting the best we can with very little time off, but. Um, Really excited to get together and like explore sonic things as well as the lyrics together. I think we've also had some nice conversations about bands that totally went completely f far out. On a <laughs> One of my favorite second albums of all time was The Bends, um, with Radiohead. I thought they really took a nice step. I thought it was a great step. There's so many. There's so many records. Um, people. Um, have taken nice steps, and they're so fun to celebrate them because I think that people, the common person, might just think, "Hey, it's our second record." But I think as an artist, you know if you can pull that off. I think Bon Iver just did it. Mm -hmm. um, if you pull that off, it's really saying something about your future. Let's go!